Take a fresh look at Nebraska's state capitol. Its 400-foot tower looms over Lincoln, a landmark visible for miles. But when visitors come inside, many are surprised at the artistry and elaborate symbolism that unfolds. Here, elementary school students visit the vestibule on the second floor of the Capitol. The vestibule's theme is Gifts of Nature to Man on the Plains. The mural, called the First Furrow, was painted by James Penny. This mural, called the Homesteader's Campfire, is also in the vestibule and was painted by James Penny. Windows between the vestibule and the foyer are made of Utah white onyx. The stone softens the light passing through it, which was intended by its designers to create a solemn atmosphere. The floor of the rotunda is made of marble and is named Earth as the Life Giver. Mother Earth is in the middle of the design. The walls of the rotunda feature quotes from Aristotle and Plato. This one reads, Men should not think it slavery to live according to the rule of the Constitution, for it is their salvation. Light fixtures in the Nebraska State Capitol feature agriculture influences, including corn and wheat in their design. The West Chamber is where Nebraska's lawmakers do their work. It is named the George W. Norris Chamber after the founder of the unicameral legislature. Mosaics representing American Indians, the first Nebraskans, cover the ceiling of the East Chamber. It's used for special events now that the state has a one-house legislature. The state law library is frequently used by lawmakers and their staff. The library's featured mural, painted by Elizabeth Dolan, was recently restored. The law library's reading room also houses stacks of books. Carved details above a bookcase depict animals on the plains. Colorful books in the reading room shelves create their own art, while pillars inside the reading room feature a wheat motif. Images of famous Americans, like George Washington, adorn the outside of the second floor balcony of the Nebraska State Capitol. While many associate the Capitol building with state government, it is also a place of great artistry and beauty.